Welcome to the latest show ever, the show that's so late it's early. I'm your host, Mr. Mask, and we have a very special show for you this evening. But before we get down to Bell Tax, I'd like to take a moment to thank the inescapable Tom Nook, and a very special thanks to the lovable Isabel for fulfilling all your island needs. Oh, and today marks the 13th episode with no end in sight. What a milestone. Congratulations, Mr. Mask. You have such a huge career behind you. Thank you, Coco. Wait a minute. Seems like just yesterday you washed up on shore here. Time flies when you're a little piece of shit. <laughs> I'm just kidding. You seem like a good guy, but I get zero joy out of talking to you. On that note, I'd like to introduce our guest this evening. He never counts his chickens before they hatch. He's chock full of feathers for a henway. What's a henway, you might ask? About five pounds. The one, the only, Egbert! Welcome to the show, Egbert. Um, how are you doing over there? Is everything okay? Oh, yeah. I just feel so at peace. Oh, this is a really, really plush chair. I could sit here for decades. Just me, in a chair, on a chair, a couch. What was I talking about? I'm not entirely sure, honestly. Oh, yeah. So, thanks for having me. You know, I'm not an advocate for drugs, but, uh, did you ever drop acid? really gets the mind going. You never really know where your mind's gonna go, but you end up going. You feel like you're drifting through a space-time, like through a space stratosphere. But anyway, the, the, these chairs, I feel like I'm chair-locked. What the fuck? I'm beginning to think there's something in the air down here. I haven't felt like this in a long time. You ever smoke a shit ton and get chair-locked? Yeah. Hmm. So, did you do anything constructive? Outside of your debilitating vices? I craft. I'm a chicken of my craft. Typically working with various shapes of wood. All kinds of wood. Any wood you can think of. How very fascinating. What do you do with said wood? I build premium tables, chairs, doors, windowsills, desks, well, cabinets, dressers, bed frames, rocking chairs, Recliner chairs, TV stands, regular stands, podiums. Okay, so... Wait, 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 wait. There's a, there's a couple more. I recently got into bird cages. Oh, yeah. And garages. You know, there's probably like 20 more. How much more time do I got? Because I can really go into the list, the pricing, the specs, all that. All that jazz. Were you interested in any of it? The only thing I'm interested in is why I could say cock on the air when referring to roosters, but when I just say the word cock, they bleep the living shit out of it. So, Egbert, do you have any plans to expand your business? I know Tom Nook would be more than happy to help. No. I kind of... I'm more of a settler kind of guy. Some villagers like to expand and do stuff elsewhere. I just kind of like to sit and let the mind wander. Yeah. I like the island. That is quite interesting. But before I forget once again, I would love a new desk or perhaps even a podium. Let's go with whatever it is you see fit. I would be delighted. I would love to craft, to formulate the most perfect desk, to emulate whatever prowess you have as a villager. I always say life, you gotta break a few eggs to make a good omelet. In your case, I'm gonna have to hammer a few nails into some good wood to make a desk of your liking. Oh, look at the time. It's the Wheel of Death. You know, I don't really, I don't really want to do it. Can I come back another day? I just don't feel like it. I just want to sit in this chair a little longer, take a good seeing position, a flight to space, or a distant land, think about things. Yeah, that's the dream. Ah, yes, so I'm gonna get going. Wait a minute, you can't just leave. <laughs> now this is what I signed up for. Ah, oh, well, you know, time is just a, a fabrication. It's not real. But it's running out for me, so I'm just gonna get going. Because that's all the time that I'm gonna fabricate for myself in this moment. Oh, no. Not again. Hello? Yes, I'm aware. Okay. Bye. Uh, Coco? Where's Egbert? 
I guess you could say that one flew over the cuckoo's nest. <laughs> Did you even attempt to stop him? It's funny you ask that. If you haven't noticed, I can't really move around when I'm down here. Well, this isn't good. Okay. Until next time, I'm Mr. Mask. This has been the latest show ever. The show that's so late it's early. Don't forget to smash that like button. And if you enjoyed tonight's episode, please subscribe to my channel. Stay tuned for next week's episode with a brand new guest. Good night.